Hello Leo and Crosswatcher, how are you guys doing today? It's your girl, it's Tisus. I am here today with another legitimate reading for Leos or Crosswatchers. Put your thing down, flip and reverse it. It could be for you or the Crosswatcher. So, how are you doing Leos for... Uh, my readings are usually timeless, but so you could say for November 1st if you're that person. But they're usually timeless. So how are you doing Leos? Welcome to Planet What's Tisus. <laughs> Um, so when I was definitely Leo, I was here in opposition, so I'm not really sure what that's about. I feel like it was more of, um, a work-related situation more than anything. It could be romantic, but I definitely feel like, um, more of a work energy with opposition. Like, there could be a lot of people trying to steal your ideas, Leo, so just be aware of that. That's what I was hearing. Like, um, you could own the lash tech and you just, uh, you, um, trying to make your own lashes from scratch. And then another bitch behind you come do the same thing, Leo. But she did hers with nails or so, something weird. Like, someone here is trying to, um, one-up you. Thank you, spirit. Thank you. One-up you, Leo. So, you know, take that how it resonates. Yeah, I'm also hearing opportunity, opportunist, so be aware of that as well. Someone that's an opportunist coming into your life for opportunities. This is you or someone else or someone here using for someone for, you know, uh, it's like a someone here that's using someone for something else, basically. You or someone else, Leo, be aware of that. I'm hearing that there is a goal that you would like to meet, Leo. Now, I don't know if this is regarding money. Could be pinnacles. Yeah, with this higher friend energy coming out. It could be pinnacles or it could it could be a status. That's what they're saying here. A goal that you're trying to reach. It, like I'm saying, a work environment. I'm getting three of pinnacles energy. Like people working together or um, trying to maintain, maintain something together. So this could be a relationship. Yeah, it could be. But I, I feel like it's more of a work situation. Or you could work with your partner. That could be the case there. All right, let's see, Leo, for this general energy. Like I said, put your thing down, flip it, reverse it for you or cross watchers. So let's see, give me some for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Give me some for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Okay, so yeah, okay, Leo. We got the Ten of Pentacles coming out, the Knights of Swords in reverse with Justice energy. So I'm definitely getting like a, a court gathering or someone here fighting over something like legal. That's definitely what I'm getting here with this type of energy, Leo. So this could be a foundation to something. This could be a home or this could be an actual um, relationship, co-worker, like I say, any type of relationship where there is money involved. I do see with that with this Knight of Swords in reverse, there could be some like some... um. He did discuss he did discussions about um, materialism. Thank you, um, spirit. Yes, he did discussions about materialism with the justice card out here. It could be going against the Libra, but Leo, I feel like here that you have the um, the better end of the stick here. I'm hearing that you have more, you have better lawyers than someone. If that's not the case here, Leo, you just have a better opportunity at winning at something. That's also what I'm getting here. Like someone here could um. They say split finances. Yes, with this devil at the bottom of the deck. Yeah, Leo, so I'm here could be trying to take your finances away from you. I'm here um, being paid under the table by someone. That could be the case here. Like, you could be being paid under under the table, and they're not giving you your, um, your full paycheck or, you know, just the full thing. I feel like, Leo, that you will get redemption about this. Whatever it is, like, it could be... Um, I don't really see romance out here, but if it is romantic, just in case, then it could be like someone out here, Leo, that um, they owe you recognition about something. Thank you, spirit. They owe you recognition about something. Like um, this person, I, I feel like you help this person with something or they help you. That's what I'm getting here, Leo. And someone here needs recognition for that. Or someone here feels like, you know, you only you're only there because of me. I don't know. Okay, let's see. Be aware of someone trying to end something for you because you have the top spot. That's what they're saying. You have the top spot. Like, yeah, Leo, it's like justice out here. Like, you get something or something belongs to you and they're trying to, trying to take it away from you. It's still yours, no matter what the case could be. Man, woman, relationship. Um, like I said, work, business, family. Give me more for a general for Leo, please. Or cross watcher, sun, moon, rising, and Venus. Okay, a lot of cards just fell out. <laughs> Hold on. I, this, the four of pinnacles is standing out really strong to me because it, it literally like fell inside my lap. So there could be definitely someone here holding on to something. Rather, it's finances or a person. Give me more for Leo. Someone rising in Venus. 
Thank you. Yeah, we got the star in reverse coming out. Aquarius energy. Because let's see. Give me someone to start in reverse with the five of cups here. So yeah, someone here loses something. Someone here loses a star like individual. Rather they lost you, Leo, or you lost them five of cups here. Someone here is depressed over a situation, relationship, or something like that. We got the nine of wands reverse with the six of pentacles reverse. I definitely feel like here that there was um some involvement with some money between two different people. That's what I'm getting out here. Rather, you did everything for them, Leo. They did everything for you, right? Whatever the case could be. But, and I also see a split here. It's like there's um, two different calibers here. Like there's a split between the foundation because of materialism. Nine of Wands reverse with the Six of Pentacles reverse. Someone here is um, not giving anymore. What this Nine of Wands reverse is like someone here is um, trying to heal from this. Yeah, it's like um, Leo. It gives me, I don't give a fuck energy, honestly. We got Empress out here. Someone here could be pregnant. Knight of Cups in reverse. King of Pentacles in reverse coming out with the Six of Cups in reverse. Yeah, definitely. I definitely feel like here where there's a falling out between a couple or like any situation to where um, someone here isn't holding up their end of the bargain. Yes. It's like someone here is bringing Ten of Pentacles and the other person is bringing um, destruction. It's like someone here is bringing the money to the table, but the other person is spending the money. It's like someone here is, um, yeah, Leo, whatever the case could be. I don't know. Take it how it resonates. Give me more for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. If this is a business venture, it's like someone here is putting money into a business and then someone here is just like running the funds up. We got the King of Cups coming out, Leo, with the Three of Swords in reverse coming out. Give me more for this King of Cups and the Three of Swords with the higher for the reverse coming out. Leo, there could be some bad advice out here that you took from someone or someone here took from someone else. Be aware of getting advice from motherfuckers that uh, don't do shit in their life. That's what I'm getting here, Leo. Like, someone here gave someone some bad advice about something. Or someone here was, like, telling someone to do something different from what they were actually doing. With this higher fit, higher fit in reverse, this individual, they're not a leader, Leo. They don't lead. They follow. So, this is a this is motherfucker that uh go by Facebook quotes or some shit like that. Like, oh... It's like some real real dumb shit out here. This could be a um, father figure is what they're saying, Leo. Or this could be a mother figure with this King of Cups. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, and I got Taurus out here. Yeah, father or mother figure that tell it they like they lead you in the wrong direction or they lead someone else in the wrong direction. It's like not good advice out here. So you could be asking about this um, legal situation, Leo, to this person or some separation to this individual. And they're like giving you terrible advice about it. Let's see. I do see an um, Aquarius out here, Leo. It could be an, an Aquarius or it could be you. This person, they're sad. They're lonely and, and sad. Five of Cups, depressed. I'm like hearing sad songs. If this could be a breakup between you and someone else. Give me more for this start in reverse with the Five of Cups. Yeah, Seven of Swords in reverse. It's like someone here is doing something sneaky with finances. And someone here doesn't appreciate that. It's like someone here is using something for using somebody for something. That could be the case here. Like, oh, you put in all the effort and I get the I get the I get the outcome in the end. Nine of Pentacles here. And someone here is not okay with that. Seven of Swords in reverse. Someone here feels betrayed or someone here feels lied to. I got Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Aquarius, Gemini, Libra. Yeah, Page of Swords coming out. Okay, give me more Page of Swords. With the Two of Pentacles. Okay, so now someone here wants to know the direction a situation is going, Leo. I feel like this is something related to, like, a family situation. Yeah, world in reverse. I feel like here that a cycle, someone has a contract with someone. Like, if this is a court case, this is a long, a long drawn out court case. Like, you're going to be showing up to court like the next two years, year and a half for whatever this is. If this is a situation or relationship, it's like you have a contract with this person, Leo. You and this person have a contract together. So there is like, this is a cycle. This will happen again. If this doesn't get resolved, it will happen again or you will stay with this person. That's why I'm getting here, Leo. Like, it's like something is, yes, look, yeah, it's like a contract, it's like if someone here doesn't hold up the contract or they, they, you have to get out of this contract, basically, whatever this is, Leo, rather it's a court situation 
or it's you know a relationship like debt debt has to be paid thank you spirit yeah debt has to be paid so if this is you leo that was fucking off with somebody money or taking someone's money or they said capital capitalizing off someone then this is a contract you will be stuck in this contract until debt is paid off because whoever this is the star card aquarius energy could be an Aquarius, could not. Just take it how it resonates. Whoever this is, this person, um, let me see. Give me more. Yeah, look, look. Judgment with the Knight of Wands in reverse. Someone here will um, wreak havoc. That's what they're saying here. It's like, um, God his, hears this person's cries. Rather, it's you or them, Leo. So if you got been boozled, hoodwinked by someone or is done wrong by a um, superior or in a relationship, where someone here used you for something, Leo, or them, take it how it resonates. With this judgment, it's like this judgment is like somewhat karma. So if someone here is capitalizing off you, Leo, you was paying for everything, doing everything for this person, this person, they will receive karma for being immature. And they're saying um, non-efficient. Yeah, it's like someone here is wearing a mask here. Either you or them, Leo. I got Sagittarius out here strong. Um, I got Sagittarius, Leo, Aries, yeah. Okay, give me a couple more cards for Leo. So I'm going to rise in Venus for the general reading, please. One more section for Leo. We got the Knight of Cups in reverse coming up with the Hermit in reverse. Yeah, someone here feels lost now after losing some court case or someone here thought that something was going to work out, but it, it, it backfired somehow. That's what I'm getting here. It's like someone out here tried to capitalize off someone, but this person, this contract, it stays. Whatever contract that this is, relationship, business, co-worker, whatever the case could be, this contract stays until some debt is paid off. Rather that spiritually, literal, or, you know, financial, whatever the case could be. Take it how it resonates. It's like someone here feels lost now because of this. Could be a Virgo. Give me more. Give me more for this tournament in reverse with the Knight of Cups. We got the Queen of Cups coming out. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Then we got the Four of Swords in reverse. Yeah, someone here feels stuck in like a... They said time loop, so someone here doesn't know where they are. Like, someone here could be traveling in states. Yeah, five of pentacles out here. Someone here travels too much, or they move around too much to with the point where they don't know the, with the time zone. That's what I'm hearing here. Anyways, yeah, but someone with the four of swords in reverse, someone here will be stuck in a loop. It's either they're stuck in a loop about you, Leo, or you stuck in a loop, a loop about them. Okay, give me more. Also, what I see out here with this Knight of Cups in reverse with the Hermit in reverse, someone here does not know how to um, make their way towards someone for a Swords in reverse. Yeah, we got the Lovers in reverse coming out. Gemini energy could be a twin flame soulmate relationship with the King of Swords and the Hangman. Yeah, so someone here is like... The King of Swords, that's more of a um, fantasizing fin type of card with the King of, um, with the Queen of Cups out here. It gives me the energy that someone here is um, hung. Thank you, Spirit. Especially with the hangman out here. They're hung up on someone. Either, you, or either they're hung up on you, Leo, or you're hung up on them. This feels completely different from what this is, though. This feels like another situation somewhere in about Leo. That could be the case out here. You or someone else. Yeah, it, yeah, with the lovers out here. Okay, so someone here does not know how to make their way back to a twin flame or a soulmate. Rather, it's you, Leo, or rather, it's them. This person, they're hung up on this individual. Rather, they're hung up on you or you're hung up on them. It's like someone here with the King of Swords is thinking about someone or on how to approach someone. The Hermit in reverse out here, Virgo energy. Yeah, with the Ten of Wands. It's more of a burden than, yes, it's someone here is burdened by approaching someone. Rather, you're burdened, Leo, or they are. Like someone here is scared to approach someone, talk to someone, um, give someone love. Knight of Cups in reverse. It's like someone here is holding back from someone. Well, okay, Leo. Um, yeah, that has been the reading. Yeah, someone here was stuck in the contract with somebody. And on another on another note, I feel like that someone here was giving out bad advice, whoever that person is. And on another note, it's another situation out here, Leo, where someone here is uh, they said avoiding each other. That could be the case. Someone here is avoiding someone. They're avoiding you. You're avoiding them. I don't know, Leo. Anyways, that has been the reading. It's your girl, was Tisus. Make sure that you like, share, comment, and subscribe. I love you guys a lot. Bye.